Gathering of the Storm, Chapter 2, Journey to the City of Gold As the group continued their journey, they faced challenges that tested their skills and their resolve. Elena was forced to use her archery skills to fend off a pack of wolves that had threatened to attack them in the middle of the night. Gormir had to use his strength to move a boulder blocking their path, allowing them to continue their journey. Zephyr used her wind magic to create a gust that helped them cross a treacherous ravine, and Elendril used his elven magic to heal Galadriel when she was injured during a skirmish with a group of trolls. As they neared the city, they began to feel a sense of excitement and anticipation, but their excitement was short-lived, as they soon learned that there was an even greater threat to the city than the Duodain. Galadriel met them on the outskirts of the city, warning them of the sorcerer who was lurking within its walls. She explained that he was a powerful and dangerous wizard who had been manipulating the Duodine for his own ends. The group was stunned by this news, realizing that their mission had become even more dangerous than they originally thought. But they refused to back down determined to stop the sorcerer and save the city. As they approached the city, they could see the duodines swarming around its walls like ants, their eyes greedily fixed on the golden towers and shimmering streets within. The group knew that they had to act quickly if they were going to save the city from destruction. Elena, take out as many of those duodines as you can, Gormir commanded his voice ringing with authority. Zephyr, use your wind magic to disorient them. Galadriel, use your wizardry to create a barrier around the city. Elendril, you and I will lead the charge and take out as many of the duodine as we can. The group sprang into action, each using their skills to the best of their ability. Alina shot arrows with deadly precision, taking out one duodine after another. Zephyr created gust of wind that knocked the duodine off balance, leaving them vulnerable to attack. Galadriel created a magical barrier around the city, protecting it from the sorcerer's evil magic. Elendril and Gormir charged into the fray, their weapons flashing as they fought off the duodine. The battle was fierce and intense, but the group fought on, determined to save the city at any cost. As the battle raged on, the group began to realize just how important their bond had become. They had come together as strangers, but now they fought like old friends, each knowing the strengths and weaknesses of the others. We can do this, Elena shouted, her voice ringing out over the din of battle. We have each other! And with that, the group redoubled their efforts, fighting with renewed vigor and determination. They pressed forward, taking out the duodine one by one until finally the last of them had fled the city. The group stood triumphant, their chests having their exertion and their faces lit up with joy. They had saved the city and they had done it together. Galadriel turned to the group, a small smile playing at the corner of her lips. We make a good team, she said softly. And the rest of the group nodded in agreement, each one realizing that they had found something special in this unlikely group of heroes. <laughs>